Registers of Scotland's new Digital Discharge Service, or DDS, is our online tool for discharging standard securities. It replaces the paper-based process with a fully digital service that centralises the activities of solicitors, lenders and ROS in our online portal. Getting started couldn't be easier. DDS is integrated with our existing digital services, so current online ROS customers will find it a familiar setup. Simply access the eServices portal and select Discharges on the left-hand side to begin. To request a discharge, start by selecting Create a new discharge request. DDS uses the title number to pull data from ROS systems, including proprietor name, address and securities. Once you select the appropriate security to discharge, you're ready to get started with the request. This screen shows the borrower's name, designation and other details. You can update these if required and any changes will be updated on the discharge deed the lender will sign. If you are happy with the details, click continue. Here you should input a mortgage account number for the discharge. This step is based on direct feedback from our customers. During testing it was consistently highlighted as a key requirement, so we've listened and made it a mandatory step. You'll next have the option to enter a reference number for your own records. We'll use this reference number when confirming the title sheet has been updated. ROS charge a £50 fee for each DDS application, a £10 discount compared with the paper service. Like our other digital services, this is taken as a direct debit. Just select your available FES account from the drop-down to continue. To keep you updated at each step, we've introduced a notification system. This will default to your login email address, but we've also provided the option to enter three further email addresses if you wish to add colleagues or clients. All addresses will receive an email from ROS upon receipt of the discharge application, as well as acceptance. If the lender declines your request, the notification will be sent to the first email address only. All the details are now complete. Here you can check them one last time before submitting to the lender. If anything needs changed, just select the Change button and it'll take you back to the appropriate screen. Don't worry if you don't wish to submit to the lender just yet. You can still exit the screen and the system will automatically save the draft. When you're ready to submit, select the green button at the bottom of the screen to send the request to the lender. Once submitted, your request code will appear on screen. You can also download a PDF copy of all the details submitted. The discharge now moves to the lender. If accepted, you'll receive an email notification within 24 hours confirming that ROS has received the application. Once we've updated the title sheet, you'll receive another email, again within 24 hours, with a link to the updated title sheet. As mentioned before, you can use your workbook to revisit saved applications. Just select Request Discharge on the left-hand menu. The workbook lists the status of all your discharge requests, so you're always informed. You can also view full details through the green button.